Good afternoon. It is 4 p.m. here in South Korea. I am Arirang News AI anchor, Ari. President Yoon Sogil looked back on 2023, saying the economy took a turn upward and that an improvement in exports will drive the country's growth next year. The president was speaking at a cabinet meeting on Tuesday at Sejong Government Complex where he also said the nation's current account surplus is expected to be around 30 billion U.S. dollars. Japan is seeking to turn South Korea and the European Union into new export markets for scallops, amid China's ongoing import ban on Japanese seafood products. According to local reports on Monday, Japan's export goal for 2025 is to reach around 461 million U.S. dollars. Tokyo scallop exports were hit hard as Beijing, its biggest export market, and seafood imports from Japan, following the release of Fukushima wastewater in August. The South Korean movie December, 12 the day, has become the most viewed film released in Korea this year. According to the film's distributor Plus M Entertainment, the movie has recorded 10.69 million viewers up to Monday. The movie is based on the December 12 military coup in 1979 which led to the establishment of South Korea's Fifth Republic. It is the second movie this year to hit the 10 million milestone after the round of No Way Out. The United Nations Refugee Agency has called on China to ensure human rights for North Korean refugees ahead of a UN review. The UN High Commissioner for Refugees recommended that China ensures that persons of all nationalities, including those from North Korea seeking asylum in China, are granted with humanitarian space. This comes amid reports of human rights abuses of North Korean defectors, including human trafficking and forced repatriation. Israeli attacks continued in Gaza on Christmas Day, with some 250 Palestinians killed in a single day. Israel's finance ministry is expecting the war to last another two months. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu once again stressed eliminating Hamas as a prerequisite for peace. That is all for today. Thanks for watching.